to an alien. I better get going. Have good day at work, husband. Mwah! Babe, you're too good to me. I just left my car in stall four. Perfect, I can take it from here. Okay, great, and I apologize, but my son threw up in the back. Okay, it's no problem, we can clean that up for you. Thanks, you're the best. Hey, Levi, we got a backseat vomit in the maroon PT Cruiser. Levi? 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 <sighs> Hey, uh, so I'm really sorry, but I threw up all over the front seat. Not a problem. Thanks, man. Late for a flight. Levi? 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 Hey, I accidentally barfed in my car. They told me I could leave it here. Yeah, I'll clean it. Thanks. I gotta catch my flight. Levi. Levi. Uh, this one looks good. The uh, second cheapest one. I'd actually recommend that first cab there. Sound good. I love cab. That second cheapest one sounds great too. We'll take that one. Indulge me in one more work story? So last week I put this nice family in a Sonata. Those are supposed to be great cars. <laughs> Actually, uh, yeah, they're, they're not great. They're okay. Anyway, he says he'll fill the car up before he brings it back. He opts out of buying our gas. Which is like 10% of less than anywhere in town. That's right, babe, but that's his prerogative, as Mitch says. Mitch is my manager. So fast forward to this morning, I get the car back, I check the tank, three quarters full. Cohog, we have a problem. <laughs> Stewie, you're so funny. It's from a movie. Anyway, that's a 150% markup. Turns out he was late for a flight and figured it's worth it to eat the nine bucks. So, yeah, a Wednesday.